Eh, hello guys, we are on 2.3, okay? 2.3 says Mary gave one third of her money to Nazim, okay? When we are talking about one third, we are talking about one over, okay? We need to analyze that statement, okay? It means that we use N for for Nazim, okay? We use N for Nazim here. We are giving the, the, the Nazim there, okay? Then it means Nazim is having Nazim is having one third, one over three of Mary money there, okay? We are giving it like that. They say Mary, we use M for Mary, okay? Mary gave one third of her money to Nazim, okay? It means Nazim is having one over three of Mary's money, okay? Then it continues, it continues to say, uh, and Mary, Mary, they say Mary gave one third of her money to Nazim and one fifth of, of her money to Elue to, okay? Elue to, something like that, okay? Then we are going to use E4, Elue to, we are going to have E, okay? The Elue to is heavy. 1 over 5 of Mary's man, okay? They say 1 fifth there, okay? We are having 1 fifth. It means uh, LUA2 is having 1 fifth of Mary's man, okay? Then we are having it like that, okay? Then the statement continues to say, LUA2 received 28 rents less than uh, Nazimi there, okay? It means LUA2 uh, there, Elue is having uh, 28 rents less than Nazim, okay? It means uh, Elue 2 so money is uh, 28 rents less than. When you're talking about less than, you're talking about the, the, the negative there, okay? Elue 2 is having uh, uh, Nazim so, uh, so money uh, less than 28 day, okay? It means Elue 2 so money is is less is less compared to Nazim uh, money by 28 rands a day. Okay, that's why we are saying Nazim uh, subtracting the 28. That's what a uh, Iluit is having. Is having Nazim's money uh, by less by 28 rands a day. Okay, then we know that the the Iluit is having one over five. 1 over 5 and Mary's money there, okay? Then let's check the question there. The question is it, how much money did Mary have originally, okay? Then it means here we need to get the M, okay? Remember, M is Mary's money there, okay? Then we know that Elue is having 1 over 5 of Mary's money, okay? Then when we see E, we substitute 1 over 5, okay? M there. Then we know that uh, Nazim is having one over three of Mary's money there, okay? Then when we see N, we substitute that, okay? Then it means we are going to we say, therefore, uh, we are going to have one over five, one over five, M there, we substitute the E. Then here we are going to substitute the, the N with one over three there, one over three, M there, subtracting the 28, okay? Then now we must solve for M, okay? Then we need to take this m to the other side with isolate variables. We're going to have 1 over 5 m subtracting the 1 over 3 m there. Then here we're still having the negative. We will remain with negative 28 there, okay? Here we are having 1 over 5 minus 1 over 3, okay? This is m and m. These are like terms, okay? Then we can romance them. Then we can just come on our calculator to say 1. Uh, 1 over 5 subtracting the 1 over 3 there, okay? We are having 1 over 5 and 1 over 3 there and just subtracting. Then we are going to have negative, negative, negative 2, negative 2 over 15 m there. And this side we are having negative 28. There we, we are having it like that, okay? Remember, we are looking for m there, okay? Then we want this to disappear. Then we're going to divide by it again. Negative 2 over 15. Even this side, we're going to divide by negative 2 over 15 there, okay? Then our M should be in range there, okay? Then we see what we get there. Then we're going to say 28, negative 
28 there, okay, dividing the negative 2 over 15. Then I get 210, okay, then it means uh, we are having 210 rands there as the mirror's original, its original amount, okay. Then we've answered the question like that, we've answered the question like that. Okay, then Mero originally have this amount. Okay, if you are having any question, you can ask. Bye.